How you going? It's Phil from Aussie Garage. I'm here with Nick. Hey Nick, tell us about your ride or what's happening to it at the moment. My ride, Rewind. Yep. Um, 1978 AZ panel van. Yep. Um, fair bit of custom work was done to it. Uh, the 350 Chevy, Jag diff, awesome. Turbo 350, uh, Fitec EFI, which unfortunately let go back in November and caused a fire, which was pretty catastrophic. Yep. Um, uh, van was written off. Uh, we lost pretty much all of it, uh, yeah, but no we're in process of uh, rebuilding it now. Yeah, absolutely. I see him working in the shed at the moment on it. Look, it's looking good for what it was compared to when we first got it back here. So, well, it's yeah. a good start. I mean, that's the old front end of the the van. Uh, pretty much uh, buggered. Yep, um, yep. The interior is over here behind us. That was the interior of the van. Yep. Um, we'll throw up some photos later of what happened to it, the the fire, the whole lot. Yeah, yeah, uh, awesome. And where we are with it now, so. Yeah, um, not a problem. So what's the plans for it? Plans. Uh, Without revealing too much, of course. Well, we're, we're going an LS1 with a six speed manual box. Oh, nice. Uh, coupled with the Jag diff, so that'll stay in. Um, twin light. AZ Premier front end, oh, perfect. Um, which I've picked up uh, from Bunbury uh, in, in Great Nick. Now that's um, good. Interior wise, uh, we'll probably leave that till later. Yep. I won't reveal too much just yet. Yeah, of course, absolutely, mate, absolutely. So I mean, at the moment, obviously it's starting, like um, how long do you reckon before you may be able to get yourself back out on the, on the road? Oh, next week for sure, no, <laughs> no problem. <laughs> Uh, look, considerably, probably about another year, I reckon, before okay. we can you know, get, get it on the road. Yeah, no drama. But, um, all right, well, that's cool. Well, at least, at least it's getting on, it's going forward anyway, uh, yeah. which is a bonus. Um, obviously, like, you're the president of the West Coast Vanners. Okay. West Coast Vanners Incorporated, yep. yep. So, basically, tell us a bit more about the club and what you guys stand for and everything else. So, West Coast Vanners uh, is a group of um, people um, who have the same share the same interests in vanning. We encourage people with vans and utes of all types and ages to join the club. Yep. Um, we offer uh, C4C or the Concessions for Classics registration yep. um, that helps uh, pay, um, well, reduce the rego down by 75% yep. uh, for qualified vehicles. So any vehicle that's uh, built up to 1990 uh, and is registered can be on C4C. No, that's perfect. Um, we've almost tripled our size since May uh, last year so I'm pretty excited about that. Yeah we've been um, doing quite well with that so it's good. Yeah we've and we hold we we've taken the bull by the horns pretty much and we we've uh, taken over um, carriage of the WA van state titles. Yep. Uh, so that's held used to be held uh, biannually. We now hold it yearly at Max Pinjarra at this stage. Yeah, because uh, at this stage it's uh, been postponed to the 24th of April. Till 24th of April so, because of uh, WA's COVID status. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, look, everything seems to be moving forward great on that. So that's perfect. Yep. Um, so what's the plans for the future for the club? Uh, future for the club is that we'll keep on going forward uh, with what we do. We'll increase our events throughout the years increased our, our membership um, yep. we don't necessarily do membership drives uh, we don't really need to yep. uh, but we want to encourage people to, to join us help us grow help us pr promote um, vanning in WA and Australia yep. um, and yeah just to, uh, increase some um, community uh, knowledge and inspiration and uh, um, support. Yeah, absolutely. And you guys do a lot of charity work as well. Um, we, so who do you sponsor at the moment? We do, yearly we do a uh, toy run uh, from Quinana to uh, up to Hillary's and out to Whiteman Park at the the, um, the uh, Motor Museum. Yep. And we do that for Variety WA. No, awesome. Uh, and, we all, and we support them financially throughout the year as well with other things that we do. Yep. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, mate, um, look, is there any advice you've got for people that are trying to get into a van or a ute and doing it up and things like that or want to get out there with the, with the club? Kind of got any advice for them? Don't. No, no. <laughs> no, look, it's a great, it's a great thing. I mean, a lot of the guys in the club have been, been, been vanning since, since the, the 70s and 80s. Yeah. Uh, it, and it, it's a real 
niche market. You know, a lot of people have Commodores, Tiranas, Fords, um, Ford sedans, um, yeah. but it's very rare to find a, a group of people that have um, just panel vans and utes. Yeah, absolutely. I oh, know, mate, not a drama. Well, look, we'll leave it for that for now and we'll catch up with you on, throughout the process of your build. Um, but thanks for talking to us at Aussie Garage and we'll catch up with you shortly. No worries at all. Awesome. Keep on banning. No drama, mate. Never do before uh, And even when you 
feel low, you can still go Even when you feel slow, you can still go Even when there's no hope, you can still go I never answer to no man, I still go Go, go Until next time.